Hi, welcome to the Gidon Minecraft Navi project. It's very laggy. Okay, but anyways. So, Gidon is working with his father. Threshing wheat. And... He looks outside. And he sees pay no attention to these. Sorry. Okay. Okay. So, you don't look that side. And spotted. An angel. Which. An angel. And he said, oh, I'm an angel of God. And he didn't really believe him, so he said, okay, prove it. So he said, he, these things are really annoying, but so he said, well, then prove it. So he done went home and he bought lots uh, uh, soup and meat. Just ignore these. I'm sorry, I have to do this. But all of that he gave. To the angel. Put it all, the angel told him to put it all on the rock and pour the soup over it. So he did. And the angel tapped it with the tip of his staff and it went up in flames. I have to get these out of my way. They keep pushing me and it's quite annoying. And it went up in flames. But it wasn't raining. So after that, he dove into God, and God answered to him. Oh, jeez. Well, God answered to him that to do this, he must cut down the Asherah tree, build a sacrifice for Hashem, and uh, sacrifice his father's cow. So that's exactly what he did. He started cutting down the whole tree. I'm not gonna do the whole thing because it's a very large tree that I made. But he cut down the tree and he used the wood to build an 
altar for Hashem. And he took his father's bull, which was extremely fat. He'd be sad, uh, fattening it up for seven years, which these can't get any fatter, but there's a bunch of hay for it to eat. As a spider chases me. Which I will not allow. But, so... He takes the cow with him to this altar. Come on, Mr. Cow. Quickly, he wants to get you into the altar. And what he did then is he sacrificed the cow to Hashem. He sacrificed it to Hashem and slaughtered the big fat bull. And the Jews. They started. They started spying on the army. It's very laggy. Very sorry. If it was my choice. It wouldn't be laggy at all. Sorry that it's so much monsters. This is taking a while. Because they're so annoying. But essentially, they heard them talking about their dream where the bread knocked over the whole tent as the Jews were spying on the army. It's kind of far. I'm sorry. I messed up on that. But these Jews were spying on them and they overheard them and. The person said that it means that they will be defeated by the Jews and be wiped out. Uh, but, uh, yeah, the army, and that's really all. Bye.